everyone, I'm Christopher Walker, and today we're going to be talking about how to schedule an email. So what you're going to do in your Gmail homepage, you're going to come up to the top left-hand corner and click on Compose, and that's going to open up your new message window for you. You're then going to put in um, who you're sending it to, their email address, and then put in a subject. So maybe it's technology tidbits. And then if you have a message for them, you can put that in there. Make sure you fill all that out, including if you want to add links or attachments and stuff like that before um, you get to the schedule send part. That's really important because you can't go back and edit. Um, so once you're done, you're going to go over to the send button, but don't click on the send button. Instead, you're going to go to the right side of it and you'll notice there's a drop down um, arrow. You're going to click on that and then you'll notice it has this schedule send option. We're going to click on that. Now that's going to open up a new window for us and uh, you'll notice that it has some preset times like tomorrow morning, tomorrow afternoon, um, stuff like that. Those are usual times of like um, maybe start of the work day or, you know, after lunch. But you do have the option to create your own time and date and that's down here at the bottom. So you're going to click on pick date and time. And then you have this calendar on the left side. So pick the actual date you want it to send. So I'm going to take, uh, pick Friday the 25th. Um, and you'll notice that shows up right here as well. And then you can pick your time. So maybe I want to send it at 11 o'clock. And then I can change this to AM. Now, once everything is set the way I want, I'm going to come down here and click the blue schedule send button. And there it goes, it's now scheduled. And you'll even get this message in the bottom left-hand corner that says send scheduled for Friday, October 25th or whatever date that you pick. Um, and you could go from there. Now, if you want to go back and check on your scheduled messages and make sure that you have you know, them all set up for whenever you want, if you're on this main screen and you go to the left side in this nice little column that we have here, there's a scheduled um, section and if you click on that it's going to open up this new window that has all the different scheduled messages that you have you'll notice ours is right here if you click on it you can go in and look at it um, again you cannot edit it so if something's wrong um, what you'll have to do is you'll have to delete it um, so if you go back out and click on the button you can click cancel send um, and that will delete it so that it's not going to. And actually what it does is it sends it back into a draft. So you'll notice down here, you can go to drafts um, and you can see it right there. And then you can go back in and edit it and then go back through the process and schedule the send. Um, so I hope you enjoyed this short tutorial on how to schedule an email.